By lowering input costs and becoming more time efficient, Cascade farmer Rod King is reaping the benefits of adopting a bells and whistles approach to precision agriculture. Over the past six years, Mr. King has spent more than $100,000 on technology, including variable rate systems, to provide support to his 5,800 hectare broadacre cropping operation. GPS-based variable rate technology was employed to take the guesswork out of fertilizer application during seeding time. Now it's across every inch of his farming system, including his gypsum, lime and spraying programs. I think just the whole input cost, trying to lower them, that's what we're mainly after and trying to put the product where it's needed most so we don't you know, lose out in any yield. With the latest EM work I've done, I can sort of recover that in probably two years, um, just in lowering the fertiliser cost. And uh, you know, then you put it over 10 years and, it, and it's, it turns out to be a reasonable sum of money. The introduction of PA techniques is made even easier by the advent of iPad-based data sharing, which enables Mr King to more easily interact with his agronomist using programs like Dropbox. A bit of record keeping, a bit of ease of use, trying to um, get data back, or we use Dropbox quite a bit, so it's a lot easier for uh, receiving data on that and downloading it onto USBs um, to go into monitors. Uh, at this stage, that's that's pretty very helpful and so quick and easy to do. He was encouraged to apply iPad data sharing technology to his farming system through his involvement with the South East Premium Wheat Growers Association. Supported by the Grains Research and Development Corporation, SEPWA is a farmer initiated group that was started in 1993 to represent wheat growers in the Esperance Port Zone. SEPWA Project Officer Nigel Metz has been assisting farmers in upskilling and taking advantage of the available technology by developing plans to suit each farmer's level of understanding and size of operation. In Rod's situation you load up to a monitor and you can actually generate a report before you send that out to your monitor and you can uh, generate a product usage report and that gives you the whole breakdown for each year, each paddock, how many hectares will be spread, what's the rate in each of those hectares, what's the total tonnage. Um, so in terms of those larger programs you can start to work out well where do I need to put my gypsum or lime dumps, um, how many tonnes should be in each one and then uh, make a plan from there on. Mr King says there is still room for improvement with PA and iPad data sharing, but already these techniques have enhanced his farming business. Occasionally there are problems created from, from the technology, but you sort of get around them. Overall, you're in front. You're definitely more productive because of it.